Hello and welcome to this quick tip. This is a quick tip about using your free sky or jumper radio or well any radio potentially in something like Windows. Now I have a video where I talked about how to set up the radio for use in something like a simulator and I've just been trying to test out the latest simulator from Curry Kitten. Uh, links down below. It's free. It's very very good and I have run into a problem. And it looks like Windows in its fantastic way that it does has done an update and has buggered the way that this works so if you are plugging your radio in via a usb connector at the bottom into windows and it isn't being recognized let me show you how to fix it it's really quite straightforward so here we are on the computer and let me just start the fpv simulator it could be anyone this just happens to be curry kittens uh really quite cute it's all fpv you can actually chase planes you can chase cars around, uh, which is how I uh, really got into it all uh, when I was running FPV. Now, unfortunately, it says no joystick or radio detected, even though everything is plugged in, which is a little bit of a heartbreaker. And you can see here it isn't being listed under game controllers, and I can't see it in the normal place that you'd find it in Device Manager. And to find and start these things, you just type Device Manager in the bottom in Windows, then up it comes and you can find everything. Now, there is this little device here, Better USB HS, which is under Lib USB Win32 devices, and that's actually the joystick. Now, to fix it, what you need to do is go into here, say Rollback Driver, uh, answer whatever you want for this, but I'm going to say the previous version of Driver performed better, it even worked. We're going to click OK, close and look immediately free sky trialers joystick has appeared back in the game controllers and it's also gone back in the hid section human interface devices so now that we have got all that working i can restart the simulator and away we go so that's the trick if you ever have this issue fire up device manager find that area roll back the driver and you'll be away Thank you for watching my video and watching right to the very end. If you want to find out what I'm currently working on, you can follow me on social media by searching for Painless360 in the usual places. If you'd like to become part of the inner circle, then you can become a Patreon. Details are in the description and you get lots of additional benefits. Check out the playlist section on the channel too. I organize all of my videos into playlists and it's called something like Introduction to or for Beginners. All of the content is aimed so that you can start at the very beginning and it teaches you that subject, starting with simple principles and moving up to teach you everything you need to know.